to know. It seems like anymore there's always a couple of them. You yeah. Know, same last name. That's good, though. Charlie Winter watching from Muncie, uh, working on his car for next weekend. So that's good. Thanks for being with us, Charles. Brian, you got any shows coming up for yourself? or? Uh, I, Not for myself. Probably not this year. Maybe yeah. next year. I think my brother's going to run a show down in Terre Haute in October, River, maybe. River City Rampage, uh, are on the you 17th. Ready? There's one down there. Yeah. So. We've just been we've been so busy and we've got spent, you know, a lot of tonight, hard work on Mark Star getting it good, and good for him, make yeah. sure it was good to go and so that's good. Cars are fired yeah. up. Joe Anderson announcing, doing the uh, arena announcing here this weekend and boy this is exciting. I'm nervous. I am uh, I'm excited for Mark, you know, oh, yeah, he's, know. A, he's a good friend of mine as well as a, a boss, you know. And one more time, Rampage. Just want things to go well. Yep. Yeah, he's been behind, out, out from behind a little for a little while. But, yeah. Well, hopefully it comes back to him pretty yeah. good. I just like sitting here and be able to hear them engines roar, you know. Three, two, Toby Heath one, watching from Ohio. Three, Thanks, buddy. Three, Thanks for being with us. Everybody's going to come off the line here. Some a little slower than others. Seth Downing watching from Ohio. guys had all day to kind of work out their strategies and their running partners and then it all got thrown in the trash yeah. and he's got redrawn at the driver's meeting. Uh, yeah, Mark went from 9 to 1. Yeah. I, I prefer to really eat myself. Yeah. Oh, oh man. It was good shot so good. <laughs> I mean, it was a bad shot for Mark, but it was a good shot. Yeah.
Feel good? Good. Nine. Yeah. That's nine. That's nine. Troy is... Oh, yeah, you yeah. That's three. High, high or something. Mark might be on the wall here. Red flag on the track. For a wheel. How they doing so far, River City? I want to say thanks to everybody that's joining us on Facebook. If you like what you're watching, you can say thanks to Jeffy's Fab Farm for giving you a, a live look in here. You can check out his website at jeffysfabfarm.com. And if you were liking the show here, you can uh, pick up the ticket at DerbyNation.tv and watch the whole weekend. we got all the action here today. we got a Concy at noon tomorrow and then all kinds of classes in the afternoon tomorrow. 2.16 uh, getting pulled for Mad Dog. Now we'll be looking for the top three. So we're taking four out of each heat. We'll take a mad dog and then three. Yeah. Not really. Yeah. Okay. We're going back at three, two, one, three, three, green. We're back to green. Pretty sure it marks up on the wall looking for a little help. Sticks broke. Tough break for Mark. That's too bad. Hopefully it's something you guys can get put back together for Conti. Yeah, hopefully it's good. That's for sure. Cardinal is bad. has been on it this whole heat. Hood's vibrating. These guys know how to turn the base up. Sean Reese checking in out of Indiana, as well as Toby Heath from Ohio. Tyler Stevenson. Jordan Burgess watching. Fourth from Iowa to the dip. That's to the DTD fan cafe. And uh, Russell Terry out of Arkansas. Jonathan Painter. Gary Clemens here in the 79, working the wagon. Hey, jump the stuff. Oh, jump that one. Boy, he might, it's heat number one, and we might have somebody in the running for the jump on fire. He's still on this one, yeah, he's a jump fire. Maybe the ball stuck on it. It looks that way, yeah. yeah. Give it up for that 80 car, folks. 
Shameless welding red flag. Thompson in the 80. Helmets coming off. What would you all think if we took 80 to the feature two as a bad I like that about Tos is uh, somebody earns it. They don't just stop at the one, you know. That's going to be a hard one to fix. <laughs> yeah. But I'm sure he can pull her down, put four plates on her, and let her eat. Yeah, plates help a lot. Yeah. Got some sandbagger balloons out here. Barry Clemens, he's gonna get our first. <laughs> I wouldn't balloon. wouldn't expect that really on Barry. But I'm sure he'll wear it with pride. First question of it is, is anybody gonna notice that balloon and do anything about it? Right. You know, that's the biggest thing. Here we go. Back at it. Five cars battling it out here, looking for two spots. close view. drove hard early and now paying the price. He lost, so he lost some steering in that car. Remember, if you like what you're watching, there's plenty more heat still to come here tonight. Tons of action tomorrow. You can get it all at DerbyNation.tv. If you like what you're watching now, you can say thanks to Jeffy's Bath Farm for giving you a live look into the action. Ooh. Either one of them. No, definitely not. 
buried it there pretty good. Yeah. The other three play it right. They might be good to go. Yeah. Bent about as perfect as you could ask for. Huh? I know. I was actually looking at that. And I said, man, he really done his homework on the back of that thing. Did something right. He did. That'd be a nice car for tuck at roof and break out the nine wire tomorrow. Trying to find someone to hit, he was almost there. Makes contact with the 10, keeps himself alive. He's going to have some work. Wagon finds himself in the corner. Dusty was keeping him there. Like he's waiting for somebody else, isn't he? Yeah. Curtis Hammond in the wagon. He's talking to George off camera here. And he says Curtis won the Blizzard Bash singles mod class last year. Last year. So he's, he's got the ability, and you can see it in the, in the build. I mean, yeah. the car, is, oh, yeah. the car is where it needs to be. That's holding up real good. That's for sure. Take your heads. contact. Thank you. 
the center of the eighth door. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's tough when they're both moving. Oh, yeah. I always just worry for guys. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hopefully, like a cage. We've, we've all got good door shots. I mean, oh, it happens. Yeah. yeah. Another one. Gotta have a good rear ender on this class. Yeah. yeah, they're trying to beat, beat them up like you that's for sure. Yeah. yeah. That's for sure. Mm. Ooh, that thing's packing that's in a little harder now. Yeah, it is. That thing does start pretty hard. Yeah, it is. See, but oh, it yeah, it's, it's moving around. He's starting to lose the frame in the middle of the car. It looks like it's dropping out. Yeah. Five cars battling back and forth, need to get down to two. Nice shot there. Yeah. Yeah. Frame rail's just about on the ground now. Derby Products, trackside cam, bringing the clay right into your living room.
Messi's look like he's been in front of the, front of the retires. Uh, I kind of thought that, but uh, it looks worse on the passenger side than it does the driver's side. Yeah. Swing and a miss. Sort of. The wheel is bent bad, isn't it? Yeah. back in the day when somebody would blow a radiator and they would pretty much immediately be done. Oh, yeah. Now it's yeah. like, oh, yeah. whatever. Yeah, exactly. run, run, run. That's for sure. Technology has come so far yeah. in the engine. Oh, that was back when it was just a bone stock 350, you know? Usually. Yeah. Looks like we're down to, what, four? Yeah, the, the uh, 154 is over here on the left side. Yep. Yeah, just because they're a little radiator doesn't mean that that's it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, keep that last rest of them. All of them. Starting to think Dusty's having issues steering, but it looks like it worked all right that time. Yeah. Impact every product's track side cam. Oh yeah, the, the lighting works pretty really well here. Oh yeah. Nice clear shot. That was perfect actually, but right when it's well, before the show started, the sun set. Yeah. So there's no glare or anything. Pretty nice. Out perfectly. It's a nice fairground. They did a real good job here. Yeah. Stevenson messaging the BTV fan chat page. He said Dusty's frame is starting to dump behind the front doors. Yeah, we saw it too. We were just uh, trying to give him the benefit of the doubt there. Yeah. Uh, he'll fix it. Yeah, it's fixable. Oh, yeah. Especially, I mean, he, he's got all the right equipment with him and everything. Oh, yeah. The car looks out like new.
10 knew better than to take that shot. Turn the wheel. you that are watching on Facebook if you like what you're seeing you can always join us on DerbyNation.tv for the whole event we've got multiple heats here tonight consolation at noon tomorrow and then all kinds of classes and features uh, starting at 5 p.m. tomorrow afternoon you can, uh, get your multi-pass ticket at DerbyNation.tv that will include all of tonight as well as the on to tomorrow and all the evening classes I want to say thanks to Jeffy Strab Farm for providing the sponsorship for this live look-in, giving you a taste of the action here at River City Rampage 2020 in Henry, Illinois. Yeah, the back end of that wagon was looking good. Yeah. <laughs> Nose comes up any farther, he'll be in the running for the jump to the board. Yeah. Guys are all struggling here, trying to get down to two. And number 10's been without water for yeah. a while. Probably 10 minutes now. Yeah. that are watching uh, DerbyTees.com is having a sale this weekend. 20% off uh, in honor of our hometown Derby. If you're ordering this weekend on DerbyTees.com, use promo code RCR20 at checkout to get 20% off. Sale ends Sunday.
talking about three and a half cars still running out here. Hammond's machine looking a little rougher than the rest. One to ten on the wall. That might be it for him if the bumper's hooked over the berm. Oh, the bumper looks like higher than the one that <laughs> looks like. Yeah. Looks like it is. Came down off it all right, but no, he was digging a pretty good hole. He got some help from Barry there. What's going to happen? Trying to get him to back up. Dusty, Hammond, Clemens. They're trying to finish it. Ten's a little frustrated. Barry made contact, kept himself alive. He's looking for a window and he gets it. on the clock, he's going to run out of time. Hammond in the wagon took his hit and pulled away. These guys know they could be the final two here, so they're just sitting idle. Don't want to use up what they don't have to. It's going to be it, I believe. Something happened to Barry. He wasn't able to get down there and make contact. Yeah. I don't know if he didn't have reverse and he just drove himself into a spot. But unless the back end of that being on the ground just hung him up. It's possible, yeah. See that again. As you can see, they got the next heat already lined up on the track. They kept them away from the middle wall so that if anybody went over, they wouldn't be near it. See what we can do about drivers list for you fans. Still don't have anything off out of the announcer stand yet, but they're coming through. I want to say thanks to everybody that joined us on Facebook and thanks to Jeffy's Fab Farm for giving us the live look in. If you liked what you saw, make sure you're picking up the ticket at DerbyNation.tv. We got plenty more heat still to come tonight. Constellation tomorrow, a youth class, mini madness, old iron, and the 80s feature all in the evening tomorrow night. So pick it up at Derbination.tv. Thanks for being with us. Well, I think I better get down there and take a look at Mark's car and see what yeah. he's got going on. And then text George, let us know so I get some words. Yeah. I appreciate yeah, it. I will. Brian, thanks for being with us, buddy. Thank you.
looking at heat number two. 